and welcome to Bench Monster TV. I'm Ashley Lynn Condre. And I am the Bench Monster. Thank you so much for joining us this evening. Great to have you here, as always. We appreciate you spending your Thursday evenings with us. Yeah, yeah. It's good to be back. Uh, wasn't sure if we were going to do the show tonight, but uh, I thought it would be good to move forward and make an attempt. Um, yeah. I don't know if I'll be my yippity exciting self, but I'm here to Great. do the best I can and, you know, try and take those baby steps forward. So that's what we're doing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, got some update on my neck. Uh, we went in and saw the doctor and we talked about a fusion, which we don't want to do. Um, we talked about a disc replacement, uh, yada, yada, yada. Anyway, um, a lot of those have um, some uh, re um, adverse reactions, and I guess a fusion, if I fuse one disc, then the ones above it eventually will have to be fused. Um, so what, uh, I guess the MRI wasn't too clear, so basically he wants to do a CT scan and a cortisone shot. So that's going to be the first step, and got that uh, appointment scheduled. I actually have to do a consultation first, which is a hurdle. And then the um, next time I see this new doctor, we'll do the cortisone shot. Never had one in my whole life, but hopefully it makes a difference. Uh, we will find out. Um, that being said, you want to roll right into... Actually, you don't have anything to say. It's been mm -hmm. a week or two since they've seen you. How, how's your training going? Anything exciting in the gym? Uh -huh. Bench-wise, squat-wise, deadlift-wise? We don't have any videos Just for you today. I, I Yeah, I had a few that I was going to send, and... I just, I didn't get a chance to. I, I started to this morning thinking maybe you could add some last minute and I just got interrupted and it's just been a crazy busy day. Um, like I ended up normally like this is my night off of coaching um, and I would go to the gym and I'd, I, I would have been able to maybe like have time to do it. But right. um, I got called in to my other job, my gymnastics job um, and that they needed somebody to cover tonight um because we had some somebody out sick imagine that right now right yeah and so um so i i just got home about 10 minutes ago um so just just been super busy um and so i didn't get a chance to put those videos on. Well, i'll right. have to do i'll have to put those ones on um next week a lot of the videos that i have are videos that i had ready for last week and um last week i had oh that's right yeah I, I had the show up. Had it all prepared. I had it up. I posted it Thursday. Then my sister would give me a phone call with bad news or good news, and this, then I would take the show down. And yeah, it was a roller coaster ride, and it's been rough. But um, rough ride for sure. I just want to take the steps in life and move forward and do you the things know that your mom would. Want. She she was like she watched. Mom all watched this show. Yeah, on, on the she, replay. She never watched live. I don't think. But. Well, I don't think she was. Able, she wasn't. She had to wait till, um, you know, till your sister was home and could get it going for her yeah. and stuff. But I think she watched every episode. At, sure. You know, um, at some point, I think she, you know, made sure she got all of them in, and so we definitely wanted, like you said, take steps forward. We yeah. Know that's what she would want us to do is, you know, keep the show going and. Yeah. Um, I don't know if many people know we're here today. I, re I really never advertised this on Facebook. That, in fact, I have not been on Facebook. That's another thing. Um, I know that I made, I made a post last Thursday, and I have not been on Facebook. I did not. Um, I need to go on there and and post to the people that thank everybody. Thank everybody. I just haven't done it. It's um, that's going to be another hard thing to do to go on there and see. Every, I'll read everybody's post, and it's going to be um, uh, a tearjerker. So I'm just. Scheduling a day to do that, and I've just been putting it off and just nervous to do it, and I need to do it. So, um, that being said, I've been tanning a lot in the gym. Haven't been lifting much. <laughs> been uh, just hanging out in the gym last, what, few days? Yeah. Just kind of hanging out in the just tanning room while and... she works out and uh, bench the other night. Workouts in. Yeah, I had, a, yeah. had an okay bench night the other night. Almost tore my shoulder off, but we'll talk about that later. <laughs> It's, uh, what was I supposed to do? Go in on max effort night and only go to 315. We talked about it. You, you asked me, what what should I do? I, I know. I said, well. Haven't lifted in a week. Feels, cause he did, like, on, when I was, we were in there on Monday, and I was benching, and you, like, did what I had, and, like, it felt really oh, good. Oh, horrible. No, remember? You did the plate, and you're like, that felt so good. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and so we, we well, talked about it on Tuesday. You said, so what should I, what should I do? What should I plan B? And I said, well, see how it feels. If you take out a plate and it feels like it did last night, then, 
you know, if you can work up to three plates with no pain, do some reps with three plate, three plates with no pain, right. come home and I ask you what you, you said, you almost broke your shoulders. <laughs> and I said, Oh, doing three fifteen. No. And actually, then what'd you say? Oh, no. I, I, I went up to like 700, 700 and, and Miss Grooved. So uh, somebody didn't quite follow the plan. Yeah. Miss Grooved the Atlas a little bit, but it happened to Heinz too. You know, it kind of rolled back on me twice and almost ripped my arm He's off. He's not broken though. Like Yeah. Well, it's hard to go I, in there and, and not lift heavy with the guys when they're no, pounding out weights. I but know. let's uh, I got a short I list get, of, I get that. of videos. We'll I just get uh, get those rocking and uh and uh yeah, we'll do that. So the first up is uh, a lifter uh submitted video here. Um Farron Parker. Uh I think I believe his wife uh, submitted this video and uh wanted me to critique it and uh, I said, well, better yet, you know, I'll put it on the show. And um, let's take a look at uh, Farron Parker doing 600 to a two board. Let's see what Farron, Farron's got to offer here. Looks like he's in a Pharrell, wearing the shirt correctly. I have watched this already. Relatively close grip than I would go, um, but strong as hell. It's getting the groove of that uh, band shirt down. Ooh, oh, I'm wearing the tank too, sir. Smooth, yeah, that's yeah. good. I don't see butt up. I see Dang, good feet placement, like, yeah, and um, I can't, I can't take anything away from that, Farron. Congrats, good job, great Way lift, and um, yeah, I got nothing, nope. nothing yeah, but great good. things to say about that lift. Look easy, look smooth. Paul Loeffler uh, sent me some videos, quite a few of them, and. Uh, We'll just uh, roll with Paul Offer's videos here. Check it out. He's doing 635 to a three board in the first video. If I have them in the correct order, we will see. Or what did I, did I play that right, Ashley? Yes, I did. Okay. Yeah. I should put the backing up. Maybe I'll just do that too, so I don't have to look it up. <laughs> that uh, Pharrell shirt there looking really good on him. He's got the... Uh, Overkill wraps on that he got one on the giveaway on the Bench Monster TV show. Oh, nice. <laughs> that's right. Wear him. That's so cool. That's really cool. That's a tight fitting shirt. I like what I see. Yeah, that's good. Let's see what the lift looks like. Building that shirt correctly. Oh, easy. Easy. Nothing wrong with that, Paul. No, that was good, man. Uh, what's up? Paul's got another lift here. 765 to a two board. Let's roll with that. If I got the lift correctly here, I believe I do in the email. I did this. I do make mistakes. But not here. <laughs> I wonder if that's a two ply or a three ply that Paul is wearing. I probably should know that. Settle that weight in, looking good. Spread that bar. Oh, geez, more in the nice. tank. Oh, yeah, put some weight on the bar. Put some weight on the ball, Paul. <laughs> look good, look really good. Ah, uh, who's up next, Ashley? Uh, looks like I got it a looks few. Looks like another one of Paul. Uh, Tim O'Dell. Oh, okay. Tim uh, O'Dell I... sent me a video. He's doing 225 for five pause reps. Tim, a uh, uh, Bench Monster TV family member here. Trying to get his bench oh, out yeah. to 300, 315, and above and beyond that. Boom. Nice line. He is pushing in a nice line. Good good call, Ashley. Elbows aren't turning out. I love it. No. Very nice. Looking good, Tim. It's very clean. Yeah, looking really good. Okay. Uh, Jimmy Kolb. I got two Jimmy Kolb videos. Um, as probably everybody's seen by now, the 1400. Well, I got two videos. So, so crazy. one uh, he sent me and one was online. So let's check out the first Kolb 1400. Let me repeat that. About 1300. <laughs> I know. I 1400. 13. On a one board here. My Lord. Good night. That is crazy. I've never seen that many red plates on the bar ever. 1280 to a four board is my best. <laughs> that was a long time ago when I was younger. Jesus, Jimmy. Wow. Like, That's so crazy. Speed? Gosh. 
Ah, I got to play another one. Yeah, yeah that was that. Oh, I'm gonna play that again. Jeez, that kind of gets yeah, me let's excited about. Again. New, can we watch that again? Sorry. Instant replay. Yeah, the, folks. The, the, the speed, man, off the board. I, I just, wow. Perfect handoff. No teeter totter on that three man. Jimmy's got a good crew. Contact and ju oh, oh Jesus, son. Dude. I want to make a comment <laughs> about his shirt after we watch the next uh, Jimmy Colt 1400 Part 2 is what it's called. It's just a different angle, I believe. Look at that shirt, though. I'm impressed. That looks like uh, w the Widowmaker, I believe. Is that? No, that wasn't the name of it. 1400. It just... I just, I just can't get enough of that. I mean, f 1500 next? Ashley? Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, like yeah. It, it's just on and on and on. I can watch it. I mean, maybe do a double. <laughs> wow. Jimmy. <laughs> this was a good shot here of how you, of how the shirt is actually uh, working there. Very prep. Jesus, man. man. Now. Wow. Uh, Jimmy contacted me and we talked a little bit and I believe Pharrell specifically made that shirt for him to bench uh, just as he would in his poly. Uh, so I'm assuming that's an elbows in type of uh, design, which when I get done with all my um, shenanigans with my neck and, and I'm able to bench again, I would definitely love to have a shirt that would uh, kind of mimic that uh, elbow in type of technique. Uh, Cody Plum. We got Cody Plum in here. What's he doing today? He sent me a video, 615 to a two board mm -hmm. in a metal ace. Uh, uh, Cody's got a ton of shirts. I and spoke... these are regular shirts. This is not a band. Not band this shirt. No, these regular... are poly, poly blend shirts. Yeah. Over 600. We talked the other night and he's got a, a, he's got about as many shirts as I do, I think, the way we were talking. <laughs> and uh, 615 to a two board in a metal ace and I uh, kind of suffered a small peck strain you know when we talked on the phone it was a strain we didn't really uh, really say it was a tear yet or anything um but he said it was a strain he felt a little bolt of lightning go across the um upper pectoral as you'll see in the video when he sits up and we're hoping it heals and mends quickly and there is no black and blue oh, man. but uh cody can do it in any shirt metal ace oh, Inzer. Easy. he's got speed too Dude, yeah. yeah oh speed for days Oh, good, but, man. Yeah, so I, I I left this little extra in here because when he gets up, he uh, has that little zinger in the uh, looks in the like in the upper pectoral oh. tie in there a little bit. Hopefully, icing and um, taking care of it, a and... little peptide in that or something. You know, heal yeah. up quick, Cody. Was, uh, West Mc... man. I got Wes Very McCormick impressive. in here somewhere. Where's Wes? Up in here. Okay, Wes McCormick, uh, West Side guy. You remember Wes? We hung out with him I at the do. Arnold. I do. Seems like really a year ago, him. but it was a long time ago. He's a badass. Now, Wes suffered a hamstring tear and a pec tear yeah, and had, had a bunch of injuries. Some bad luck there for a while with yeah. injuries. Definitely. But of course, uh, anybody he hangs that goes in there, he's a warrior. Well, anybody that goes out and trains with uh, Pharrell personally, um, they come come away with great things and uh looks like west mccormick was out visiting and uh he's doing a 700 in a pharrell f8 they got him dialed in and i'm impressed with uh west here he's gonna go he's gonna go a thousand he was telling me so you know baby steps here i'm sure it's that peck's not a hundred percent yet but look at him go out there with pharrell spread that bar looking oh looking good <sighs> nice yeah nice. west was very happy man yeah yeah, I bet. Yeah. I would be too. Yeah. It's good to see him in a in a <laughs> band shirt. You know, we talked we talked about it uh, a long time ago, but uh okay, what do we got now? What uh what's on the list? Am I missing anything? Oh, this cool exercise here. This I don't know where I found this. This is a bamboo bar movement, and it was just really cool because I want to get a bamboo bar and where's it at? Actually, cool exercise. Yeah. This guy's got like four forty oh. fives on there. Holy cow. I'd like to try that. But uh oh, it's right it's an now, investment. Not it's an investment uh yeah, yeah, to buy yeah. one of those bars. That bar. They're three hundred and some dollars, I believe. I don't know what the uh what, what that's rated. Obviously it can hold uh doesn't somebody 400. on our team have one that you could borrow? Uh Gormus does. does. Gormus okay. has one. Uh Derek Kaiser, buddy of mine. Uh he's getting he's strong as shit. 
right now. Derek Heiser, he's doing pin presses or rack presses, whatever you want to call them. 450 for five reps. He he had done multiple sets with uh, some other weights. So this is just one, one part of the video he sent me. We don't do enough of these in our training on Max Effort Day. And I think we're going to incorporate. This is old school. We used to do these back in 2004. And uh, they've been just kind of gone the wayside. But uh, this is, uh, these work. They do, they will not make you weak. They will make you strong. And I kind of miss them. And seeing Derek Kaiser doing them makes me want, want to do them too. again. Yeah. yeah. Gets me excited when I see things like that. Oh, okay. So uh, speed effort, max effort. What are we doing, Ashley? We got two max efforts, it's but they're kind of condensed. Effort. I wasn't there for speed bench last Friday, obviously, but uh, let's check out. When was this speed bench? It must have been, the it must have been a couple of weeks ago. We're going to roll through this real quick and see what we're doing. Well, it looks to me like we're doing the Duffalo prototype bar, not the original Duffalo. That's what uh, Chris Duffin first utilized to mimic the bar that he now manufactures called the Duffalo bar. This doesn't have such a deep curvature as the other one, and it's a 45 pound bar instead of 55. I brought in the uh, velocity meter on this day to make sure everybody's bar weight was moving at 0.8 meters to 0.9 meters per second. And for me, my, my obviously bar weight has dropped. I would normally go heavier, but so everybody, I think it was nine sets of three with uh, three different grips. Up in there. It's a wrench. So Dan Logman, as we're as you see, we're moving like pit crew here, NASCAR pit crew. Looking fast, looking good. Let's see what we got next here. Here goes Ryan. Boom, 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 fast, looking good. Okay, here comes assistant. Let's work it looks like. Got Dan with some dumbbells. Working a nice line, looking good. Oh, there I am in the background. Doing my least favorite lift of all time. Why is Hate that? Hate this lift. Sucks. <laughs> Sucks. You don't like dumbbells? No, no, I'm talking about me in the back. Oh! Bench in general. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, flat dumbbells for some uh, three or four sets of uh, 15 reps here. Ashley, that's your max effort day, isn't it? Friday? Mm -hmm. Okay. You got to let me know when to bring over the camera and get some of your benching in. Oh, if I was doing anything cool, I would. Everything you do is cool. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> the fact that you're in there and doing it is all, is all that matters. And my shoulders are bugging us. I'm like trying to do all these different shoulder movements, trying to like get them, get them woke enough. And... Chris Logman there. We're going to see him hit a PR on Max Effort Day in, in a few videos. Um, Like I said, I don't do much anymore. So it's really funny here that um, I'm counting the reps. And as each rep goes up, I feel the right arm just starting to die inch by inch. So. Okay, a little decline football bar with some kettlebells on there. Trying to make it awkward, trying to make it fun. Of course, you can do them regularly with the uh, football bar and weight. You can do them with chains, chains and bands, kettlebells, chains, bands, kettlebells, reverse band, and the list goes on and on. You can do them to a uh, pin down there and break the eccentric concentric chain. So many different ways to do just one exercise. Always throwing curveballs at the guys, never letting them adapt to training. Always keep them guessing. Their body's always guessing. Um, I don't do He's very much. Guy. Well, he used to be good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's still good. And then a little nerve in his neck destroyed him. <laughs> Jeez. Unbelievable. But I still have fun, even though it's depressing. I still show up, do the best I can. 
I have some interesting footage and max effort uh, you'll see soon where you can see the atrophy of the right tricep as we discussed with the doctor because of the pinched nerve. Uh, lateral head, which doesn't mean anything, but still atrophy and muscle loss has nothing I want to have in common with. No. I don't want, I'm here to gain. No. So we're doing some high volume here. Is Heinz not lifting? I'm not sure I wasn't. What's he doing sitting did, back there? Did he lift on Tuesday? Well, this is Friday. Er, this is, are you sure? It's speed bench, right? Yeah, speed bench, yeah. But isn't that Nathan? Nathan's not usually Nathan, there at that time, is he? Well, I thought, Nathan, I thought it was a Tuesday. I don't. Because I thought he usually got out, got there after you guys. Um, he's. I think he's uh, just getting in, in some work, too. I thought this was Tuesday. Yeah, I know, but he usually gets there so late after you guys that. He's, I thought he was usually benching. I, I totally could be wrong. I it feels he, like it was so long ago. It was, it, but you're right. This it, is it was the a couple weeks ago. Workout, yeah. So I must be wrong. Nate was in a shirt recently on Max Effort Night, getting ready for a nice. March contest, I believe. Nice. nice. I gave him some hand me downs, but I don't know which ones are working the best for him. Nice. Um, I don't know why I'm showing so much of this. I guess it's a cool exercise. Yeah, you know, it's different. We don't have the decline set <clears throat> very deep. We could usually take it up one more click, but the bolts underneath that uh, de decline are wobbly, so we need to tighten them down because it wiggles quite vigorously. All right. I'm getting tired of this exercise, Ryan. How many more sets are we going to watch? <laughs> <laughs> Dan sporting the Team Bench Monster shirt. Yeah. Actually going to get hats now. Went over looked at mm -hmm. some Flex Fit so I can get some Team Bench Monster people would love that. hats. How many people would love a hat? Do you guys want well, some hat? Well, mine are getting old. As you see, this Pharrell one I'm wearing is really worn out. All right, axle bar. What are we doing here? I can't remember. The workouts come and go so fast. Mm -hmm. Looks like an extension. Elbows in the best you can. That bar doesn't weigh very much, so... I think it's 20, 30 pounds. But I didn't bring the fat grips, and the fat grips were at the gym, got stolen. So what do you do? Jeez. Looks like it's 1 o'clock in the afternoon, so we must have came in early. This must have been Christmas or something. I was wondering, yeah, like, are you sure these are the... This is Speed Bench, yeah, from a long time ago. Was it New... It might have been New Year's New Year's Eve, Eve something like that. I think it was New Year's Eve. There you Eve. go. Actually, one or the other. Yep. Because see, it is. It's 12. It's 1 a.m. Yeah, yeah, 1 p.m. You're right. Yeah. You're right. All right. It's like I want to play with that too. Love those uh, dark side cuffs. Definitely help with any type of uh, tendonitis or elbow strain you might have. Those are glued to my arms 90% of the time I'm in there. Looks like I'm doing a ratcheting method. Come down halfway, stop, and yeah, break up the uh, eccentric eccentric chain there. Make it a little harder. Sometimes I do this on the last three sets or something, or every set. Come on, Heinz, you're on TV. Go. <laughs> what are you He's is thinking. It, is it frozen? Okay. No, he was thinking. Okay. He was in deep thought. He was thinking about what he was going to do. I guess. It's good to think about what you're doing before you do it. Now he's are got, you supposed to go all the way, to, like cl closer down to your face? Or? I think a little, a little bit more back. He's kind of more, <clears throat> more doing a press movement there, which. You can do, I mean, it's like a, I mean, he's doing right. more like a JM type of press, but that's all right. Either way, it's going to work. Either time. way. Yeah. yeah, but if you're going to do that, though, put some more weight on there. <laughs> hey, you're walking in front of the camera. We can't have that. <laughs> I don't know what, what type of volume Heinz is doing here. I think it was a burnout, maybe. This might have been the date. Wasn't didn't he have something going on? Like was his shoulder hurting? Or I can't remember. Yeah, I don't remember. Actually, my my yeah. brain really isn't it, there. It feels like don't it was so long ago. It feels like it was years ago. Yeah. Really does. <clears throat> Technically, it was last year. Yeah, it was last year. <laughs> so we must have did a burnout set there. All right. Well, that was speed bench. All right. Let's move into the max effort. Um, what was this? January sixth or something? Let's check it out. Let's keep rolling. Looks like Saved by the Bell. 
All right, uh, Forrest uh, was going to do, we're going to max out Forrest on warm-ups here before we start the main movement. And his, uh, he came in with a 385 and I believe had a 405 and then hits 430 here, 420 there, 430 here, I believe, something like that. So Forrest is moving up. Thus, his speed number, speed benching percentages will change because his one rep max has changed. And he pauses too, which is nice. Good job, Forrest. Had more in the tank too. All right, on the menu for max effort, it looks like decline to me. Looks like we got our bench bar. Um, I don't know if we were using uh, slingshots or something here. I guess we'll find out. I don't even know if I get this rep here. I just wanted to see if uh, the right arm could handle it. Stay close, Heinz. Yeah, not not as pretty as it could be. I know it sucks, but I gotta I put on an apparatus for four hundred five. I'm embarrassed, but that's I'm all. That's all I can do. Fall apart. You gotta have something to. Yeah, that's all I can do, man. It sucks. Helps you kind of keep things. I used to. Know, I can a normal day do six hundred right there. Fuck. You know, we we all know that. Though. I know. I mean, but everybody the, watching knows that. I don't know. Larry, move. Uh, what, uh, Heinz just picked up a bench band here from dark side. Cool training apparatus. He's doing uh 505 or whatever it is. Heinz going raw 500 and get that butt down, sir. There you go. All right, I'm in the little Pharrell uh, single ply bench band. Five plates and a quarter. Just want to see if I can do it. I was supposed to try to beat 585, but the right side dipped right there, and, and they took it, and I'm glad they did. I'm asking for trouble. That's all I'm doing every time I go in. Yeah, thanks for catching that, Forrest. Uh, 560, Dan Logman here in the new bench band. Dark side. Lock it out. Good job, sir. Or five, six, actually, is that 60? Yeah. Well, I got the number there. <laughs> duh. Duh. <laughs> 595 for Forrest. Jeez, nice straight line <laughs> press, Forrest. Heinz, 685. Looks like he's got the two ply frail half shirt on. A little shady handoff by us there, but we're doing the best we can. There you go. Looks like Heinz and Forrest are going head to head here. A little in house competition. That's how it works. Forrest is just getting strong, man. He's creeping on my ass. Look at that shit. There you go. Pushing a straight line. Good Jesus. job, dude. <laughs> 725. Heinz still in the half shirt. Got the red plates on there now. Straight up. Not too bad. A little buttage, but hey. A little butt up. But, I mean, I get, I get it. Me and him hey. both have the same issue. <laughs> Good hand off to Forrest there. A little three man down. Straight up, Forrest. Holy smokes. Good. Putting up, I can't do it. All I do is film. All mm -hmm. right. Looks like we decided for some incline uh, extensions here. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Took a lot of finicking to figure out where to land, where we were going to put the bar. Was it going to be above our head, at our forehead, between our eyes? I think our, uh, I think everybody's elbows were starting to feel a little bit of uh, owie owie. So I'm pretty sure I know mine were. That's why I'm grim grimacing. Hmm. Too too many extensions and rolling dumbbells week after week. You know you got to lighten up sometimes, but we don't. We'll actually go to probably inverted. Uh, uh kickbacks you'll see here that looks like a sweet spot there on the forehead i got a little rhythm going mm. we always do a lot of tricep work i mean you got to at the end of the day the bar is going to come off the chest and it's going to get close to the top and those triceps need to finish the workload up there take it over uh-huh I don't know how many sets and reps we're going to watch here. 
You mean a million like the other one? Yeah, sometimes I... Right. Yeah, yeah. this is uh, alleviates all the strain on the elbow here. Elbows. So this is kind of enjoyable. Problem is, though, you get you can swing them and not get, the, get any effect. You want to try to flex at the top. So with heavy weight, you'll just swing like a... Like a pendulum. You don't want that. No, you actually want to go up, kind of eight and four, kick back and flex. Heinz is doing perfect there. He's got his uh, shoulders yeah. pinched together. See how that? I was impressed with that shot. Yeah. Good job, sir. Smooth and controlled <laughs> movements. I'm liking it. Uh, plate raise. I haven't done these in eons, and I thought it was a good day to do them. Four sets of 10, something like that. Used to do these back in the day, and just, they kind of fell off the menu for a while. So, we bring them back. I believe that was the last exercise, and we have one more little max effort from Tuesday night. This past Tuesday night, we'll play. We'll see uh, Chris Logman hit a PR, which is very impressive. Forrest, I think, could have done 245s. He is just moving up and up and up. It's exciting to see. I like He's, he's a raw lifter, you know, and he's going to compete raw, all three lifts, but uh, I'd like to keep him in a band shirt for some time and... Um, Definitely a thousand pound lifter right there in the band shirt. Good job, Forrest. All right, we're going to keep the ball rolling here and not stop and talk and uh, move right into max effort, too. This was Tuesday night. Let's see what we were doing. Oh. Well. Yeah, it looked like the Matrix. Yeah, yeah, I thought totally. That's exactly what I was thinking. All right, I'm only supposed to go 315 on this night. Uh, yeah. Of course, yeah, I'm not. Opinion. I don't listen to Ashley, and I, I brought in the Atlas. Uh, mm -hmm. It went good there, but then it went real bad on later on. To be fair, you you listening to me giving bench advice? Is I know just kind it of went one ear out the but... other. I'm sorry. You asked me though. I know, <laughs> but I get there and the, everybody's going heavy, I know. and I, I, I want to play too. I know. But I gotta be careful. I'm gonna get hurt, and then I'm gonna yeah. have a bad neck and a shoulder. Yeah. All right. Uh, day, I guess the uh, movement here, as you see, is uh, three board press for the day. Want to get these guys uh, getting the lockout up to par, and we used to do a lot of three and four board, two board in the Phenom shirts, and uh, in the meet they're coming to do in March is uh, gonna is have to be in Phenom. No, we don't oh. have. The, Enzer is very slow at getting okay. shirts out, and it's very I disappointing. We got one. Of, did he not get? Well, it takes. Some... Yeah, we got one, but it's a sixty-four. We, we oh, need sixty twos. Right. Okay, I got you. So Phenoms don't necessarily carry it all the way to the top like band shirts do. So we got to work this. Uh... Here's Chris. He hit a PR three fifteen. This was impressive, and more in the tank. Coming a long way, this young man at 15 years old. Yeah, I was impressed to see. Um, I almost break my right arm shoulder. Yep, yeah, there Ooh. it it rolled back Jesus. on the right side, yeah. and I almost killed myself. Yeah. Okay, so um, Forrest wants to try it. Pass it around a little bit. I don't remember what happened here. Let's watch. That's 7:05, I believe. He makes it. Oh God! Come on, Forrest. <laughs> Just rubbing it in. Good job. That looks so easy. Dan and a two ply here at uh, six fifty five, I believe. Is that seven? Seven fifty five. Is this a band shirt or a regular shirt? That's a I band shirt. Okay. Two ply. Okay. I should have wrote down the weights. I thought I did. Mm. Oh, it looks like I got a Pharrell on now. It's seven oh five. Probably should have stayed in this shirt because this went all right. I just misgrooved the Atlas, I think. I wasn't supposed to go this heavy, so. This is a Deadpool shirt. A little wobbly down, not a lot of them. It's all right. Probably could have done a little bit more, but first day back in a week. 785, Dan Logman, three board. 
You can you just have a little admirer in the back? How cute. Dan's looking strong. Dan wants it, and he's training hard. Push that bar straight. Oh, geez. Yep, everything's coming together just fine. Looks like we got a thousand five on the bar. This was just kind of a. Uh, they were gonna try it and see what happened. So, of course, they did nine or something. But I thought I'd just get the big weight on here. Heinz almost gets it, but I'm close because I don't want any trouble. Mm, the left arm. Ooh, Oop. take it. Hey, good job. Good Moved attempt. It. It. Asked, uh, what do you want to do for triceps? I looked at Dan Logman. He said incline rollers. He called it. We do it. Dan's elbows hate me. <laughs> Every time we do something, they hate me. And I guess they hate me in the middle of the night. I guess the, he wakes up and they are very mad at me. <laughs> hey, but they're going to thank me at the big show when he puts up big weight. Um, right there, look at the lateral head on my uh, right arm there, atrophied. See that? That's uh, what's going on. Uh, Louis says it's a lazy head, doesn't do anything, thank God, because it's not fucking there. And I'm embarrassed. That my, my right arm is my dominant arm, so to have that uh, arm shrink is uh, depressing. Heinz staying healthy, had a shoulder tweak about, what, three weeks ago? And he's doing all right now. Looking good. Chris Logman here, like I said, PR'd 315, more in the tank. Going to do big things in March, which is eight weeks away, Ashley. March 12th. Is it March 12th? I think it's eight training Tuesdays is what Dan told me the other day, which isn't very many. You know? No. Oh. I think Forrest is going to do all three lifts there. That'll be impressive to see. Oh, yeah. I'm sweating profusely, but that's uh, it's like I got a little bit more weight there because I'm, I'm angry. A lot of things going through the head right there. Kind of deer in the headlights, but I'm just trying to find a groove and uh, just train, man. I usually don't film pushdowns, but uh, we spent so much time on three board press, we really exerted ourselves, so... Threw a mini band over the top and uh, told them to pick a handle, and we did some uh, push downs. It was a little bit, my left arm's bigger than my right arm now. That's great. But hey, muscular imbalance, or, or I'm just a weirdo. Oh my gosh. There we are. We all done. Hey, we made it through, Ashley. Yeah. Want to get over to that chat box now and uh, read everybody that uh, has posted, and uh, let's go over it real quick. Let's do it. Yeah. Let's do it. So, what's yeah. up first, Ashley? Um,. Uh... I see. Miles Parker. Super chat. First super chat. Thank you so much. That's so Miles, so thank you very much. You. Really I appreciate, appreciate that. that. Um, thank you very much. Tim O'Dell. I'm so sorry for your loss, Ryan. My heart and condolences go out to you and your family. Thank you very much. We appreciate that. And thanks for thanks you guys for thanks, joining Tim. us. We appreciate it. Derek Kaiser is Sierra there. We're not sure what that means. We're not sure who Sierra is. You're going to have to fill us in a little bit there. Yeah, Derek. Elaborate. We're not sure what that question means. Um, Paul Lawfer. Hey, guys. How's it going? It's, it's going. going all right, Hanging in Paul. there. Paul, how you doing, Thank man? Thank you for joining us. Hope you're doing well. Also, I'm not sure how to say this name. Do you know Matichu? Matichu? I'm so sorry. I know I'm... Do the best you can. Um, match of Kohut, Kahut. I'm so sorry. I'm um, sorry for your loss. Thank, thank you. you so much. And thank appreciate you for that. joining us. We, we really do appreciate it. Um, Paul Lawfer, our prayers are with you and your family. Thank you, Paul. We thank really you, Paul. Thanks for reaching that. out, man. I appreciate that. We really do. Howard Weingarten, Ryan, I'm very sorry to hear about your loss. Hope everything else is going well. And prayers go out to you and your family. Thank you, Howard. That Thank means you, a lot, Howard. man. I appreciate that. We really do appreciate the kind words, guys. We really do. Showbit Jane 
Sorry for your loss, Ryan. Condolences to you and your family. Thank you, Shobit. Thank you for joining us. Always good to see you guys. Chronic Lifts. Sorry for your loss, Ryan. Again, thank you. We, thank we you. really appreciate it. One Rep Max. Hey, guys. Bad news. Haven't lifted all week because I got the Rona. Oh, no. Rona. I'm sorry to hear that. Super gay. Yeah. I hope you're feeling really be a lot better soon. Sorry about your mom, Mr. Kennelly. You can count on us, whatever you may need. Thank you. Pre yeah, just, so, you that. know, just, uh, you guys support. reaching out means a huge deal. And, Definitely. um, absolutely. I just want to say one thing, you know, on Facebook, I'd never post my personal life out there, but I knew that going, what I was going into, I needed help. And that's why I made the post. And, um, I needed that. And like I said, I have not been on Facebook to thank everyone on there. And I will do that. It's just taken time, man. It's been a, it seems like it's been a year, but it's only been four or five days. And it's tough, man. It's every day, you know, just it gets better. And it's been a week. Has it been a week? So it'll, I mean, yeah. You know, it's, at about 2.20 yeah, this morning, it, it'll have been officially a week since, yeah. since it happened. So. But you guys uh, give me strength, you know, with the posts, and and I didn't know what to expect tonight. So this is this is um, healing within itself, and I appreciate this. Yeah, we we really do appreciate you guys. I know I've, I've we've said that a, a million times already tonight, but we can't stress that enough. We really appreciate the support and the kind words and the condolences. It, it's all very appreciated. Um, Roger Brome, just getting over the Omicron three oh, pizza shot. I'm not sure how to say that. Pfizer. Pfizer. No, it's Pfizer. Sorry. I feel stupid now. Three Pfizer shots, and I got it anyway. I know. I know. It, it like, doesn't stop it. Like, some, I think a lot of people are starting to realize that. Like, a lot of these people that were pro-vax are starting to see, okay, this doesn't really stop us from getting it. No. Like, may, maybe it makes your symptoms less, less supposedly, um, but it doesn't seem to stop us from getting it because i was fully vaxxed i had three weeks had it and boom yeah hadn't gotten sick the entire time like this has been going on for two years and i hadn't gotten sick at all and three weeks after i got it boom yeah. so um but I, i'm sorry to hear you got it and i hope that you're um, recovering soon wish you a, a speedy recovery for sure hope you're feeling better real quick um, CJ Morgani, very sorry to hear the news. It's never easy losing a loved one. Thank you, no, CJ. It's just, it's, it's some tough, tough, tough stuff and it's hard to deal with. So thank you. Thank you for your kind words. Jimmy Cobe, glad to see ya. Thanks, big guy. This shirt is something. Yeah. And also Jimmy, love you guys. Thank love you, you Jimmy. too, Jimmy. Thank you very much. It's, it's good to see you here and we appreciate you. Mary Askew. Oh, and congratulations, Jimmy. That 1400 is insane. <laughs> I, I like, oh my gosh. Very, just, just you're amazing. I know you, you probably hear that all the time, but we just, we're just blown away by you. Very, yeah, very amazing. Crazy. Mary, Mary Askew. Hi, guys. Much love to you both. I'm excited to see what Cody Plum can do in that metal ace. I know. I mean, that guy, he's going to do amazing things. Just super strong. Um, yeah, we, we love Cody and we're excited to see, to see, to see what he's going to do. We're going to kick some ass. We know that, um, tiny Meeker, definitely in my prayers. Much love. Thank you. Tiny. Thank you, Tiny. We appreciate that. We appreciate that very much. Forrest Jenkins just got done smashing the weight. Forrest. I'm sure you did. Yeah. I'm sure you killed it. We still, we still got to do that after we're done with the show. We got to go squat. Yeah. Because I like I said earlier, I had to um I had to cook. We'd normally would would squat or go to Do the gym, legs. Yeah. Um right after uh, or right before the show. Between four and six. But I had to I had to go co I had to go cover for somebody um last minute. So um at work. So we'll be doing that after this. So wish us luck there. <laughs> kinda kinda late um to be squatting, yeah. but uh, done it before. Yeah, so it's, do, it's, do it again. Do it again. I'll, I'll um, be on the leg press probably, saving my back. I'll be on the squat rack. Or pitch arc. You're gonna do the pitch arc? Just one of the we'll see who's at the gym. Or both. It should be quiet. It should be quiet, so you should be able to do whichever whatever yeah. you want. Um Tiny Meeker. Unless unless the pitch shark squat 
Hog is at the gym. No, she's there on Sunday. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Where am I at? Tiny, Tiny Meeker. Meeker definitely loved the 1400, 1400 video. Jimmy Superman Cove. Ooh, Superman. There you go. Getting a new nickname, Jimmy. <laughs> <laughs> like it. I like it. Roger Brome. Ryan, did you wear your dark side cuffs under the Atlas band? Yes, I did. Maybe I should have took them off. Um, not sure. I usually leave them on the whole time. Even under the Deadpool short shirts, I leave them on. Yeah. I don't know if that's a no-no or that could have contributed to some this thing not sitting right. I don't know. But then again, you know, my head, you know, wasn't in the game and I was just, you know, haven't haven't benched in a week and I'm just getting under there like I haven't missed a day and you know sometimes it, that's a, that's the wrong thing to do I probably should have listened to this lady and done 315 I mean I know <laughs> that it's weird me giving you bench advice no, it's but yeah. well it that is, might have been some decent advice you yeah. should have listened to and I'm knock on wood man I I, I yeah. with with no stability 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 over here the doctor said himself you know um you know I'm using a lot of deltoid to bench and um, I'm either going to wear out or do something kooky over here and have another problem. I got to yeah. be careful, man. Yeah. And and it go, I just I just forget everything I'm taught when I go in there. I know. I know. Pines it's and like forests are going 900 and Dan's going 800. I know. Shit. I know. It's tough. <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I I get that. I do. Um, Mary Askew. Mary. Chris is really doing an excellent job with his bench. And him pitching in for the crew, he's very good at catching little details. He's definitely a badass. I've said it before. I'll say it again. Coolest, strongest 15-year-old I know. <laughs> and big. Definitely. 290-some pounds. Yeah, powerful. Big kid. Like I said, badass. He's a badass, and he's coming along, and sky, Stay, sky's the limit. Yep, that's that's for damn healthy sure. And, yeah. That's for damn sure. Um, let's see here. Big, big Farron. Farron. He played his video. Ryan, thank you for playing my video, brother. It means the world to have you say anything positive about my <laughs> shape. No, you got Shitty, great form, dude. We were impressed. You had yeah. great form. Looks solid. Good intensity, oh. too. I mean, the whole, the, whole, yeah. the whole package, dude. You keep it up. Definitely, definitely. Raw Strength Society. Jason. What's up, Bench Monster family? What's up, Raw? What's up? What's up, Jason? That's Jason, right? Jason Carson, yeah. I believe. Yeah. No. Yep, we met him at Me uh, Mendy's. Mendel's handed off for him. Yeah, yeah, that was really cool to meet you in person. Strong awesome. man, right there. Um, good to have you here. Thanks for joining yeah. us, Dan Logman. Dan, bow shirts are on the way. We'll have them for Tuesday's awesome. Max Effort. Nice, very cool. Yeah, be super excited to get those and try them out. I guess calling yeah. in your uh, customer service every day paid off because mm -hmm. they were saying something like three or four weeks to get a shirt or, or five weeks i thought i don't know it takes a while but we got them coming in and you know time's running out you know we got a contest coming up and the guys don't have their uh their their phenoms so they um <clears throat> hopefully we uh, get uh 262s in and uh we can get them in work on uh tuesday night and we'll have it on video sounds good sounds good it's attack. gonna be exciting huh i know you're chomping at the bit <laughs> that's an understatement probably um thrash attack much love thank you we appreciate thank you, that thank you for being on um raw strength society more vids are coming been busy producing new bench vids yeah excellent we look forward to seeing them definitely yeah. and please you know send them to my email you know i'll put them for on the show, show. For sure. yeah we'll check them out keep this show going impressive as usual CJ Morgani, have you seen the new Texas Monster Squat Bar? If Jimmy keeps it up, that might be the only bar able to hold his top sets. <laughs> I heard about the new Texas Monster Squat Bar. Somebody was talking about it the other day, and I heard it's, uh, don't quote me, but is it like a 75-pound bar or something? I don't know. I don't. Maybe is it that much? It's a big. It's Dude. a big. It's a bigger bar. Or 65. Jeez, I don't know. Geez, so it's something different. Wow. I might be wrong. I'm, that's crazy. That's I'm curious. Now. Yeah, a 75 pound bar. I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know exactly, that's but like, I thought that's, that's what they're talking about. Jeez Louise. Howard Weingarten. Um, Howard Wine. Am I on the right one? Yeah, Weingarten, right here. Right here. Right? Yeah. Okay. Ryan, I also have to thank you. I've been doing your dynamic effort bench when you add weight as the grip goes out and and like. 
it very much. Let's see. Can you just tell what that says? And when you it. add weight at the, as the grip goes yeah. out and like like it much first three weeks. The first three weeks of doing it and it works great. Good. Yeah. Glad yeah. you're glad you're incorporating that into your training and it's working for you and you're liking yeah, it. Yeah, the dynamic effort Kicking bench. Ass still. Yeah, with the specialty bar, I don't mean interrupt. That's okay. But I got I got to get it out. But you know, it's uh usually with a football bar, an axle bar, fat grips, uh, duffel bar. We start with forty percent of our one rep, forty two, and four, and finish with forty five, and that usually um is the right speed. Um. If you can move it faster, then obviously more weight. But uh, with that little uh, velocity meter that I have, I mean, it doesn't lie. When I hook it up and I test everybody's speed, I know exactly how fast they're moving. Even though I can judge it with my eye, uh, it, I got to tighten things up and get things more precise. Because I say it time and time again on here. When I sit down and do this show and I watch the speed bench and I, I see the bar not moving fast, then I know. And I some reason, I don't see it in the gym. But when I see it on here, I'm like, oh, I got to tighten things up with these guys. But, yeah, you're doing it correctly, and I'm glad you're liking it. Alex Estrada. Alex Estrada. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, my iron brother. May God bless you with the peace that surpasses all understanding at this hard time. Nothing but love for you, my brother. Thank oh, you, Alex. I appreciate that, man. Very ma nice. Thank you. Thanks, buddy. You guys are healing power. You really are, man. <laughs> know. Yeah. I was a little nervous doing this show tonight. I, in fact, I was like, when we were just starting it, I was like, I almost forgot how to do it. That's how mind boggled I am. I was like, I was like, do, are we doing this right? Is the lights on? The neon wasn't on. I'm like, yeah, for uh, the first time ever, we didn't have. We almost started it, and our light wasn't on yeah, back here. Not things. that it's a big deal, but I, I don't think we've ever not had the light back Just on. Brain like, fog like, a little bit. Quite right. Like, yeah. Oh crap! We gotta get that on. I'm working on it. Okay, Tiny Meeker. I'm really glad to see you on tonight. I know every day is difficult, but our mothers raised us to be great to continue to do what we love. They will be watching over us for ne from now on. Stay busy. That's right. A tiny text sent me something. You know, he said uh, his I mother know. was hugging my mother in heaven, and that oh my God, that, that was awesome, Tiny. That made me smile, and made, that made me happy. I kept it in my phone, too. So yeah, that's a really cool thought. One of those you keep and you read it once in a while, and yeah, thank yeah, you. Thank you, Tiny. We really appreciate it. Um, one rep max at Mary ask you, so I just renewed my APF membership, LOL, just need to sign up for your meet. My manager at the new job even told me I shouldn't have a problem so far looking good as far as going, going up there. Oh, good. That would be awesome. We're looking forward to seeing you. It's going to be really cool. Really cool. Glad to hear that. Tiny hey. Meeker. Hey. The new squat bar is 65 pounds. You don't want to bench I with it. I thought it was six. <laughs> I thought it was 75, but yeah, 65. 65 That's the big bar. For me. Jeez Louise. Um, Mary Askew at One Rep Mex. That's great to hear. Send me your entry. I'll find lots of yummy restaurants to your taste to your taste for you up here. <laughs> nice. Nice. Vegan. There you go. Vegan. Yeah. And one rep mex at Mary Askew. Hell yes, I'll get on it. Sorry for the lag. Ha ha ha. Thank you again. <laughs> wow. We made it through the show, Ashley. Wow. We did. Yeah. We did. Wasn't too sure. This one, this show was really up in the air. You know, I didn't know. I was getting a lot of emails, you know, stating, you know, don't feel pressure to do the show and yada yada yada. But I was like, you know, I'd uh I want to start taking steps, you know, forward and continue where, you know, what we should be doing. Mm -hmm. And so this is why we're sitting here doing this. And I don't think I could have done it by myself without this one. <laughs> Kept me uh, from going crazy, I tell you. I'll try. It's it, hard to do, it, I mean. It's been, it's been a rough ride, man. And uh, yeah. I'm just, you know, things things like this happen in life. And uh, um, never prepared for them. And when they happen. No, and, you, and this was was pretty unexpected yeah it was I mean, dropped we honest. knew things were serious but we never 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 dreamed that you know we wouldn't be taking her home from the hospital yeah she was things. in the hospital two weeks prior to this all happening you know and we ran the show and we knew you know and just we thought things were gonna go good and you know and i mean she's so strong and we just we thought that she was you yeah know, it just gonna fight through you know she's been in hairy spots before and she's so strong and she usually fights through and God so came just... calling, so I guess that's how it works, you know. Yeah. And uh, she'll go on, and and uh, we'll go on, and uh, 
without um like i said if you guys did post on the facebook part of my post i will be making that i should work on that tomorrow morning i have nothing going on and i will make a post for once and thank everyone and i just don't want to i think that i have not read it and i'm not ignoring it it's just uh you know i'm, I'm just going i'm doing things as i do and that just hasn't been a priority um just yet but i know it, i need to do it it's been a week now and i'm well people, people understand hope they understand yeah, I'm, I'm not like ignoring them and it means a huge deal so i will take care of that and uh make a facebook post and and thank everybody so let's see a couple more let's see here um, i kind of repeat myself a lot but i just want to get it clear i mean yeah i know I've, we've said some of the same things over and over you know yeah. but Let's see. Oh, we got a couple more coming in here. Uh, what was the one? One rep max. So far, the only one having a problem is um, Coach. Ha ha. He keeps saying to say, and we know, we know who Coach is, right? We know who your coach, <laughs> we know is, who your coach is. Um, <clears throat> he keeps saying to save my money, drop the APF yeah. and old school shirts, and stay in IPF with the new shirts. <laughs> I'm sure he does. Yeah. But one rep has a, has a goal, you know, and he has a goal in those specific shirts he's wearing. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, you got to yeah, accomplish he's got that very goal. very specific goal. Yeah. That I got, yeah. And once oh, that achieve, yeah, is that. achieved, then he can make a choice. But, mm -hmm. but I'm yeah. sure I'm sure his coach is uh, ornery as hell. And we know who that is. <laughs> How's that going, by the way? Like any any good stories there? I feel like there was something we wanted to ask. I feel like there was something we wanted to ask him about that. But got, got any good stories about about your coach now that now you brought him up? <laughs> Um, let's see here. Mary, you did amazing. Your strength through this is impressive. We all love you both and care about you guys. Oh, thank you, thank Mary. you, Mary. We really appreciate that. We appreciate you. We love you. Thank you so much for all your support. You're amazing. Um, Raw Strength Society, sending our condolences, brother. Stay strong. Love you, bro. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you, Jason. We really appreciate yeah, that. Stay strong you too, over buddy. here. It Thank you for the support, definitely. Um, one rep, Max. Don't you worry, Mr. Canelli. We are here for you. We Thank you, one rep. That. I appreciate we, you guys, we really man. We really do. We really do. Because I know I've said it a million times, but I mean, we. Thank you, guys. We we really do appreciate the kind words. It really does make a difference. Um, and we just I I can't really stress enough how much we appreciate you guys. Um. One rep. Um, one rep, Max. LOL. Honestly, yeah. Ha, ha, ha. He keeps picking me apart and the way his crew and him roast each, each other. It's crazy. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> I'd like to be a fly on the wall during one of love, those training yeah, sessions and too. see exactly how, how, how it works with the Mendelssohn crew. You should get some like videos while well, they don't know you're videoing. Send them to us <laughs> so we can see what, I love what Scott, goes man. on so we can be like a fly on the wall. <laughs> Uh, looks like that's Dan. Nothing wrong with smack talk. LOL. <laughs> yeah, yeah. When Mendelssohn's doing it, it's uh, it's uh, good stuff. Mendelssohn might be a little yeah. above smack talk though. Yeah, I feel like he's I ruthless. One of his athletes uh, was was female at the meet, and she she told me that the first like couple months um, that he trained her, she said that she left the gym almost tears. every time in tears. I heard that. Yeah, I was like. You gotta I mean, know for Scott a though. Come on, I know, I know, but like if you don't know him, female, it, it comes across like, as brand new. You know, he comes across as a, it's like uh, it's hurtful, but a it's little old, you know older woman, brand new to lifting. Right? Like don't break. Come on, like make it fun for her. Like make it, you know. No. <laughs> hey, well on that Looks note, like that's the yeah. last one. We gotta go train legs now. Boo. Yeah. Yeah. You got anything else? We're we're trying to stall. You got any other comments? Well, I told them we want to keep the show know, light, light and tight, I know, and, and I know. Uh, you know we'll be back next week. And hopefully, like I said, you know I'll post my email as I always do in case anybody forgets it. If you have any lifting videos, you know where to find me at benchmonstergmail.com. Um, One we're... rep says you're on. When I get better and start training, I'll try to get some. Footage. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. I, I guess awesome. the word on the street too is the uh, Bench Monster Ten promo code with Dark Side still works. Um, I yeah. I yeah. haven't posted it. Um, I didn't know it was still valid. But uh, if you want to save ten percent, get yourself some cuffs, bench band, or 
Anything else that Dark Side has, definitely uh, take advantage of that 10% discount code. It's still, it still works. I know uh, my guys were picking up, uh, well, Dan, you know, picked up a hat and a bench band, and I think he got the code and got 10% off. Oh, nice. Every little bit helps, That's you know. Good. No, that's cool. That's cool. But I appreciate your videos, and uh, I look forward to sitting down and doing this. Uh, and, you know, Tuesday I spent some time doing it. Wednesday I spent a lot of time with the videos. And, of course, Thursday show day. And uh, I enjoy this. Even though it's um, repetitive and, you know, it's uh, a lot of times nothing new, but it's what you guys do out there as far as lifters and what you do in the gym and training videos and meet videos that uh, is what we're after, you know. I mean, I can sit in here and ramble about bench, and I've done it for a year and a half or whatever now, and, you know, I think I've said just about everything, but still looking to try, try to find new things to do in the gym and new ways to get strong and new angles and new, do, new uh, I don't know, apparatuses and you know bars and and uh yeah diet you know always looking for the new and next greatest thing that somebody's doing that we're not doing that uh, we can add yeah, our arsenal yep. and excel so yeah, for sure yeah well what, one rep max says legs hell yeah reverse hack squats or what <laughs> yeah i might do those we gotta yeah. i can do that yeah, in the gym squat, yeah. i can copy you there i don't know if i really want to load up that many regular. plates tonight <laughs> but uh, I might load up 600, but that's a chore in itself. Putting squat thousands. with me. I don't want to squat myself. It'd be nice to have a squat buddy. I'll box squat. I just, I just don't want to F up my back. I got a speed bench tomorrow, and I know if uh, my lower back ain't the best thing either. So mm -hmm. I got to baby that. I got to baby that. I got to baby my, my bench. And... You can box squat. Okay, we'll figure it out. I'm, I'm going to do full range, but you can do box squat. Okay, well, don't take any videos of me. Okay. 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 That's a plan. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you once again, and thank you for all the nice comments, the yeah, super we chat. We really appreciate it. Yep, thank you so much for the and super chat. That was so nice of you. We really appreciate it. I appreciate you guys being here tonight, and uh, didn't yes, know what to we expect. Appreciate on... each and every one of you, all of your comments. Sorry, I cut you off. Now well, I'm doing all it. Right. <laughs> I'm good at that. <laughs> but we really yeah. do appreciate you guys. Um, I know that's it, this is repetitive, but we just really can't stress how much we appreciate you all and your kind words and your support. It really does make our difference, and it really does help. I second that. Yeah. yeah. Without you guys, I would probably, um, who knows? <laughs> I can't tell you what, uh, well, I guess you know, I've told a few people, you know, Saturday night was probably my worst night of my life thus far in my 40-some years of being on this planet. And some of the things that were crossing my mind were not good. And I'm just glad that that day is behind me, but it was the most painful. And I've been through some shit. It is the most painful. I can't even describe it. You know, like if I can't explain to you what it, I mean, maybe you do know. Maybe you've been there. You know, and lot. You know, but for me, it was something that I I can't put on paper. But all I know is I wanted a magic pill that would kill my brain and just take the pain away because it hurt from head to toe and it seemed like there was no end. And I was having some abnormal thoughts. Let's just put it that way. And it was not good. But, uh, you know, the text messages and, and um, I have been on Instagram Messenger and Facebook Messenger, maybe not on Facebook itself, but uh, you guys have sent me a lot of text messages and a lot of uh, DMs a lot of love, and, and a lot, lot of like that. And I've been replying back and a lot of things, you know, Paul Loeffler, Tiny Meeker, Jimmy Kolb, all you guys have sent me, you know, I've uh, I rep replied back and it's been therapeutic and it's been healing and it's helped. And I thank you. Yeah, we really appreciate you guys. I know I've said it a million times, but just know how appreciated you are and how grateful we are um, for your for your love and support. You guys uh, stay stay strong over the weekend and um, be back and join us next weekend on next Thursday. Next weekend, I'm I'm losing it. I know. I'm kind of getting <laughs> next hungry. Week, yeah, yeah, next, next week. week. <laughs> next week. It's usually we'll... dinner time after the show. I now know. we got to do leg. Gotta dig deep here. Gotta find. We'll find it. Stop and get a cheeseburger we'll on the way. <laughs> <laughs> I've been eating a lot of comfort food. I had yeah, to cut that out too. We've been eating some comfort food yeah. lately. Not gonna lie. No appetite.com here, but it's I coming know. back though. Oh, we couldn't eat like a Saturday and Sunday for couldn't both eat. of us, man. Could we not eat. Couldn't eat. We weren't sleeping. We nope. were just M E S S. Yeah, it was bad. I mean, we we went Horrible. to the gym both days, Saturday and Sunday. You know, we just kept trying to do what we would do. You know, it was bad, um, but. Yeah, we weren't, you know. Doing better now. We're doing so good. But yeah. Team. We're, and now you guys, man. There, Thank you guys. Strong. Like like Tiny said, you got your mom's raised you to be strong and that's right. would want you to keep doing what you love and so that's what we're trying to do. Yep. Thank you guys and uh we'll do it again next week.
Yep, we look forward to seeing you guys next week. Good night, everybody. Have a wonderful night.